that there. I actually need to make some things. I want to make a new shovel and a new axe. So, a new shovel and a new axe. And I can hardly wait until we find diamonds. Don't worry, we'll find some. Even in a 1.0 world, diamonds aren't impossible to find. Believe me. They are rare, yes, but then again, they are diamonds. And as soon as this gets down low, we can start branch mining. So what I want to do is increase the size of this by a bit. I know what you're thinking. Why would I want to increase the size? I mean, it's already so big. If I increase the size, wouldn't it make it harder to light? But here's the thing. Mobs don't spawn on glass. Which is advantageous. So since I'm going to have a glass floor here, I don't have to worry too much about the mill. Even though I suppose I could go get those pumpkins and make jack-o'-lanterns. Well, I need to uh, farm. But since I'm really needing more stone, I figured this was a good idea. So then it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And this is the width and in the length. Of course, to set up the torches, it's going to be, let's see, about right like this. I can't really do much for it at the moment. This pick's about to wear out. Yeah, this is a good way to get extra stone gathered up, as you can see. So that's why I'm quite glad to do this. Glass is now smelting away. So I can just stow whatever cobble I got in there. And this time I'll make eight cobble. So this is eight cobble for each of these. And that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, and eight times eight, sixty-four. So I'll get a stack of cobblestone every uh, level. So that's a pretty good amount. That'll get me uh, quite a few stacks of cobblestone. So yeah, I'm gonna get to mining, and uh, of course that probably would help if I get my wheat from going. That's why I'm saying I don't want to do too many time lapses yet. Once I get my wheat from going, though. Just we gotta get some stone. I think I'll do that. Maybe that. One, two, three, four. Oh, like that. There we go. Oh, I have to admit, I like the hardcore hearts. They truly are impressive. And we have a nice suit of iron armor, so I'm uh, well protected against some of the elements. Um, I'm protected against mobs now, so. I won't take as much damage, which is good. Iron armor is good for that. Plus, I can repair my iron armor with new iron armor if this stuff, stuff gets damaged. Or I can make new iron armor, and then if that stuff gets damaged, I can combine them. And there's the glass. Unfortunately, there's another trouble. There's one thing. This requires a stack of glass for each level. Sort of a trade situation. On the bright side, I will have a lot of extra stone, so that's the only real bright side to this. I'll also have to dig out more sand, but, you know, I can go to that desert later with a bunch of stone shovels, so I can dig out lots of sand pretty quick. That's not a problem. And I'm glad to have the sand here, because, frankly, I'm going to start using up a lot more glass. Because I really do... I'm really going to need a lot more. Believe it or not, I will. Not just glass, though, but sand alone for sandstone. Because sandstone looks pretty good, so it'll be good to get lots of sand gathered for that. Here we go. Alright, let's add some glass and try not to misplace. But yeah, I got my custom map going along pretty well, so that means by most standards I will have it done, or I'll have another good amount done, where I might make another, or I might make a test. <laughs> oh man, I'm low. Darn, I thought I had enough glass. Jeez! Yeah, the floor is pretty big, alright. I think I'll mine just a bit more stone, and uh, this is an easy way to pass the time in the night. Ultimately, I need a lot more, and this means that this is going to be opened up a bit more. One, two, three, unfortunately. So yeah, the grass is all spread in here, which is good, and this is a good thing. 
Unfortunately, I do have to uh, extend this by another 2 to make it 8 by 8, I think. Well, I'll probably make it a 7 by 7 first as the test. Because I want to use this for my bones and bone meal if I ever make a... Well, I'm probably not going to make a mob... Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Didn't think of this. I'm running into my old stuff. Gotta be careful though, I don't want any creepers down here. I've had times where creepers spawn in my mine shaft. Oh man, and you're peeking down and hey, what is he doing in there? Kinda of funny. I never did catch any of that kind of stuff on camera, so oh. Well that was there. Uh, a lot of gravel right here. more as we speak, so... Oh yeah, I have to raise it up one, don't I? It'll be difficult to get good torch placement around here now. There we go. And this pick's about to run out too. As well. These stone picks really don't last long, but I don't want to waste my iron yet, because I don't have a decent amount, so stone just has to do. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There we go. Which makes this one, two, three, one, two, three. Careful I don't fall. <laughs> That'd be kind of nasty. I'm gonna keep on cobbling, cobble making, basically. And I know. Oh, and speaking of that, I know how to make some good cobblestone generators, so I can create. Uh, don't know if it's a bug or not, but if lava is flowing down and the water is on the ground, it turns the block into stone instead of cobble. I want to make a generator like that if we ever do in this world, because it'll make it easier to mine the stone. Because this takes a little longer to mine than this. So it would make sense to make it stone. It's a very interesting thing, too. Quite cool. Quite cool. Alrighty. Oh, jeez. Dirt. It's true, I do need dirt, but... I'm not concerning myself with all this dirt, so I'm just gonna dig out one to two. Two, dig it into two. Oops. There weren't any holes in there. Don't know if cave spiders spawn randomly or not, but if they don't, well, then I'm good. But if they do, then I want to be safe. I'd rather be safe than sorry, after all. Cave spiders are nasty little buggers. They can't, their poison effect may not be able to kill you, but it can certainly make you weak. Very, very difficult to deal with a lot of cave spiders when they're mixed in with all the mobs, too. I don't know. I thought about doing other stuff from Minecraft. I thought about maybe doing a custom map. Just because I could, you know. But I don't know yet. Anyway, so uh, I think now I've done enough. So I'm probably going to end the video. Especially when because it's daylight again. Let's just put away our cobblestone. And I'm just going to end the video right now. Uh, I might start up a new video. Might not. We'll see. So this, for now, this is Kanyard signing off.